Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome to The Wire. This is a little free VR game on Steam. Uh, I wanted to play this because the previous VR game that I played, uh, The Octopus Bar, was very short. So I thought I'd give this a try. Uh, I don't know what this is, so let's practice. Um, how does this work? So yeah, I got, I got this in my hand, yep. Hit the laser, hit the wire, oh. Time? Is it time? Oh, th is this the time? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay, let let's do this. Oh. Oh god. This is very in front of my face. Oh, okay. Okay, I see. Ah, I see. And I have a time limit on the side. There we go. Cool. Okay, this is gonna be really difficult, and it's gonna be hard to watch, I think, because uh, you can only see sort of just what I'm seeing. Out of range? Ah. Okay, I think you need to keep the you need to keep this part of the um, thing in a certain distance of the wa of the bars. Oh. Ah, hit the edge! Damn it! It's like operation. <laughs> Would it be easier to do it with this hand? I don't know. I think it's it's harder at the start, but it'll be easier at the end if I do it like this. I cannot see the time because of where it's positioned. They should have put it on the front, on the front panel here. Ah! I'm very inaccurate. My hands shake a lot. Oh, it actually, it actually says it up there. Okay. What the? How do I... Apparently I won. I didn't hit this though. Excuse me? <laughs> I thought it was supposed to go green. Ah, damn it. So yeah, that little switch on the thing there tells you... This little thing shows you whether or not you've started or failed. Whether you're going or you're fa- Oh, <laughs> I tried to go over like an idiot. Okay, no, it just lights up. Never mind. Ah, that part's so difficult. Ah, shit. Once again, that time I like was just too slow. Friggin', why any? <laughs> I don't know. Whatever the case, I won. <laughs> okay, I can't move like any further back. Uh, so hopefully, like, I can't really get a good overview of the map. <laughs> ah, I hit the edge. Because <laughs> it's not like, it's like quite out from my hand, it's hard to tell by the depth how close to the edge it actually is. Oh god, this part's gonna be bad. Eh, yeah, I got it. Okay. It's getting bigger. I should really move around my spot, but I'm when I start stepping, I uh ah I'm going to have all sorts of problems. I just know it. Oh, that was close. It looks oh I tried to rotate it. Damn it. Okay. While we're here. Go oh, take it slow. Oh, what the frick! <laughs> I've just been recording friggin' Bridge Constructor Portal for the last ah for the last um three hours. <laughs> I'm a little bit annoyed. Okay. I don't know why that doesn't light up anymore. Maybe I can start from there. Oh, can I start from? Oh, I can. I can start from the checkpoints. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Oh dear. Um. 
<laughs> you piece of shit. I'm moving the controller into a different position. Ah, shit. This is just brutal. This part here. Ah. Okay, let's just go like this. Ah, oh, what the hell? Let's go like this for now. Go like that, and then wait, and then go like that. There we go. Okay, next. Oh, God. It's slowly consuming more and more of my, like, personal space. <laughs> so, what have we got here? Oh, God. I hit something. It's my lamp. It's my lamp on the side of my room. Oh, see, instead of holding it like a, like a normal controller, I'm actually holding it in the tips of my hands. So, like... My fingers are like here and here and here and here instead of being like, and my my palm is over here instead of on the controller. I don't know if anyone cares. Oh. Ah, okay. Oh, freaking! Because you're not just because you're not. It's not in the middle of the controller. It's like at the end of the controller. I can't tell when I'm when I'm like this. I feel like I'm at this position, but this part hits. I get hit by the block. Like that feels like I'm in a gap, but I'll totally get hit by that block. So ah, I'm trying to go quickly now because I'm getting pissed off. Okay, I, found, I got to the checkpoint. Ah. What the hell? Ah! <laughs> okay, now I'm holding it like a freaking wand. Okay, that worked. That worked well. Okay, what have we got here? Apparently I can just start. No, I can't start from here. Why is this one... Why did I not change color? <laughs> it's weird. How far across can I go? Oh god, I hit something. How far... How far across can I go? I think this is reaching the a absolute limit of my uh, VR space. Oh, oh, piece of shit! I just have to wait for ages with this bit. Uh, oh, what the hell? Which part actually gets detected? Is it this, just this bit, or is it the whole length of the thing? I'm gonna check. Okay, wait, hit that. Okay, yeah, it's, it's just the whole controller. Oh my god. Oh wait, the one on my hand is like a score. It's not a time. How am I supposed to get this past? Uh, oh, that's freaking impossible. Are you kidding me? How am I supposed to do this? Am I supposed to like have it on an angle? And then like follow? Oh my god, I am. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what the red, what this glowing red versus glowing blue means. I don't know how I get points. I don't know what it actually is that triggers that. Oh. Okay, well I'm gonna have to actually move for this. Okay. Goes across there. Ah, I should just start it. Automatically. Okay. Oh. Too fast! Ah, oh, shit, man. That ain't cool. Oh, I got to the checkpoint, thank god. Oh, I immediately failed. Ah, shit. Okay, it moves at its, it moves straight. It doesn't, as soon as the thing starts to kink, I'm safe, ah. There we go. 
Whew, alrighty. Okay, once again, like, I only... That might actually be through my wall. No, it's not through the wall, but it's so far, it's actually outside of the... The, the, um, my play area. It, it does... This game does not care about your play area. Like, I have, I have a ton of play area that way. Like, if I look down... There's so much play area that way, but it's like choosing to go outside of my play area that way. Ah. God, that's a tight gap. Ah. Okay. No, I'm gonna have to. No, I have to go straight on. Okay, like that. Ah. Okay. Oh no, I, I need to go. I have to. I need to rush it. I need to race it. Ah, oh, shit. I keep failing on the offset instead of instead of being able to try out my method, I fail before I, the method even begins. <laughs> this is very annoying, this game. This is more annoying than anything I've played in VR before. <laughs> Except for maybe Runetick. But I feel, I feel sad. I, just, I feel bad for them because they were a very small, singular developer. I don't know how it, I don't know if this game had very many developers or not. It's made by Leak Games, which I believe is the Chinese game company. I don't, oh god, that was bad. I, I can't get the loop right. Like, it's not a natural movement for me. Okay. I can't, like, I can't do it fast either. You piece of shit. <laughs> I just want to hit it. I like games where you can just flail. This is not a game you can flail in. It's very precise, I hate it. <laughs> VR is not very precise, so I hate precise VR games. <laughs> Why am I playing this? Oh uh, dear. I'm sorry developer, by the way, if you're watching. Uh, I'm just bad at it, okay? <laughs> Don't take anything I'm saying too, with too much, like, uh, authority. I'm just not great at this game. I was not particularly good at your game, alright? It has clearly defined rules. And I'm just no good at them! Ah, oh, see, I just can't make it down quickly enough. I can't do it. As for this, this little bit here, I hate it. I definitely think it should only be this little bit that can be hit. When this part of my controller gets hit by the bars, it's so... It feels so BS. I have more control. I've actually taken my wrist strap off now. I think I have more control over it when I don't have the wrist strap on. Okay, wait for it to move. There go. Ah, oh, so close. Oh, that's such BS! Even with, like, the fastest movement I can do. Ah, oh, shit. Oh my god, I finally did it. Jesus frickin' Christ. Okay, oh my god, it's, it's, it keeps pushing further this way. Can I make the game, like, push the map that way? <laughs> Ugh. Once again, this is gonna be the, the absolute limit of my... Oh, I actually can't. I can't reach it. That's the edge of my... That's the edge of my VR space. Yeah. No, I guess that stops here. I guess the game ends here. <laughs> I can't even exit, actually. Now that I've noticed. There's no pause button or anything. I just have to leave it here. Surrounded by things. Uh, yeah. It's it's pushed itself outside. You can't actually see my, my, um, my chaperone. But that is outside of my play space. I can move. Wait, let's just put my arm out this way. This is 
This is the edge of my play space this direction. <laughs> it's chosen to go outside of my play space when I have all of this extra play space here. <laughs> this is this is the scene wait, uh here, here's the center of the play space. It's just like, oh I'm gonna put the whole map on the <laughs> left side of the uh, well, whatever the case. That's going to have to do for wires. Um, as I said, probably the most annoying game in VR I've ever played. <laughs> uh, that's why it's good to play little t trial things. It's good to have little free games to test out, because if I had bought this for money, I would have been quite annoyed. I probably would have refunded it. Um, this was an interesting test, and it's an interesting idea, but I think for something as imprecise as VR, VR has real fluid fluidity to it and often it's kind of glitchy you know it's, it's not exactly the most uh, refined piece of hardware uh, having a really precise game like this it's like trying to do those bloody mouse things where you have your where you're using your mouse and you're trying to feed it through a maze it's the same premise except you're using a VR controller which has even less uh, consistency than <laughs> a mouse does so Whatever the case, hopefully this is nice and short so that uh, it can pair with the octopus bar. I really enjoyed the octopus bar one, it was very much a, you know, typical experience <laughs> in VR. But yeah, uh, these are both interesting games. Whatever the case, if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, 